This is Young Money 287 here. I just wanted to make a quick video on showing you guys how to actually download iOS 5 because I've I viewed this other kid's video and he's been telling everybody, oh yeah, uh, he's getting the Air 3, 3200. See, my iPod Touch 4G right here. It's booting up right now. Just give it a sec. I'm I'm making this video for my iPhone 3GS right now. Sorry, I have a cold, but, yeah. Here's the little menu screen. You gotta select your region. In the United States, location services. I really don't give a shit if you guys see any of the extra shit, like my Wi-Fi and all that. It really doesn't matter. But, um, everything is actually working fine. You, But, I want to show you guys what options they give you. Hold on, I'm gonna focus that. The camera in iOS 5 gives you the autofocus feature. So during videos you can dim or you can brighten up your screen. See as you can see here, you set up as new iPod Touch, restore from back iCloud, back, back up, iTunes, back up. I'm just going to go new iPod Touch just to show you guys because I already have iOS 5 on both devices now. And uh, yeah, I'm not going to do that right now. I'll do that, whatever. You guys can see my email. I don't care. If you have any questions, you can email me. So my email is right here. So if you have any questions, just comment on the video. Or you can email me. I really don't care. I'm, I'm turning it towards my screen so you guys don't see my uh, password. I really don't think you guys care. I have no money on my account. But uh, here you go. It's signing me in. And then it gives you the, uh, like, it gives you the basic stuff about iCloud and iOS terms and blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? When you're about to update, it gives you the agreement user thing. You click agree twice, and then it says it's going to update it. And it'll say it takes a few minutes. And on the computer, I have, you get, you can get iTunes from Apple.com. Everything is official now. And, um, I think the reason why it's so shaded is because my, nope doesn't make a difference but um i can just click set up as new ipod touch because it already is setting up as you can clearly see um i'm just gonna do this for now there aren't really that many new features with um with oh yeah oh yeah this is what i want to show you guys um yeah, the new thing called iCloud, yeah, it's here. You can either choose to use it or not to use it. I recommend using it because it stores data and it backups your iPod Touch. So I click yes, back up to iCloud. It won't back up to the computer anymore. This way it'll back up to iCloud, not taking memory on your computer, and it'll also help prevent getting further errors. And it, use find iPod Touch. If somebody steals your device... It'll show you the general area where your device is. So now it has its own tracking device. And I, it really doesn't matter which one you pick. I click don't send because I, if I, if you ever jailbreak your iPod or do whatever, you really don't want Apple being like, oh, this kid jailbroke his iPod. I don't want to fix it. Start using iPod Touch. And here are all the new features. Um, You have, you have newsstand. You have reminders. Um... Where else? What else do you have? Um, you have messages. I forgot to show you guys that. It's right there. Um, and in the camera, <laughs> I, I I told you about some of the features here, but you can allow it. Doesn't really matter. Sorry about that. Later, photo stream. It sends all your photos to iCloud, and there's a grid option. There. And, uh, like, if you hold it, it'll blink. You can adjust it to the side, like, where you want it to go. AE lock. Same goes for, um, the video feature. Like, same thing. Am I really going to make another video on my iPad Touch? Makes no sense. But, yeah, I, the only reason why it's doing that repeatedly is because my iPad is short in my wire. But I want to show you guys just how you can, um, bypass the stupid error that everybody has been getting 3,200. 
Sorry, I kind of got sidetracked, but I also also did want to show you the things that you got um, the things that are actually there. All right, you go into View, you go to Preferences. Don't go to Advanced, but you go to Devices, and it shows you all your backups here. As you can see, I have HD, Ray, Ray, Ray Two Ys, Ray Prayer, and Ray Prayer. And what you basically do, what, what you want to do, is you just click it. Delete backup. Delete every single backup that's in there or else it's not going to restore. You click OK. You can click Reset Sync History. You click Reset Sync History too. You press OK. And then you simply either update or start your device, whichever one you guys want to do. It really does not matter. But that's pretty much like the gist of what you have to do. And um, if that doesn't work like if all goes to um if all goes like bad and it's still not working the only reason why it's everybody's getting that also getting that error is because uh, apple's having a hard time having all these people trying to download the firmware at the same time so what you want to do is if you continue to get that you go into your hard disk drive you go into windows you go into uh, system 32 or whatever system driver you're working on don't go to driver store you go to drivers then you go to etc and then the host file you drag this to your desktop but I just want to show you guys what you're supposed to delete you drag it to your desktop and then you go to notepad try not to do a uh, word pad because it jacks up everything up there's a bunch of numbers and GM and all that you can delete those it really does not matter if the the number symbols are still there but you pretty much delete that if only if um the thing with the preferences of, of deleting your backups did not work so that's pretty much all you have to do and if you like this video and it was actually helpful towards like to what you guys were doing then please comment rate and subscribe and if you want, I guess you can add me as a friend because my videos are actually pretty helpful. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. This is Young Money Two Eight Seven here, and comment, rate, and subscribe again. See you guys later.